Things are changing constantly, every day. We constantly think about how to improve things. It's good to be curious in this major. We all came to Berkeley like, as musicians. Going into the business, we can look at it from the musician and the artist side. People are listening to music now more than ever. This is probably the most comprehensive music business program that you can find. We cover all of the basics of business with a music industry focus. There are a core of classes all the majors go through. Business management, marketing, and accounting, and finance. We have to do a business plan. It's pretty much just like you're starting a business and you need money from investors. I've actually started to structure a business plan to join two things that I love, like the music industry, and I'm also a huge snowboard fanatic. One of the big things we talk about a lot is crowdfunding. There's more of a science to it than just luck. They go from there into one of three tracks, marketing, management, and entrepreneurial. And management would be the overview of the entire industry where you have a class that's dedicated to live concerts and touring and a class that's dedicated to music intermediaries, publishing. Tim McKenna, Live Nation, promoter rep, House of Blues, production manager. So here we are at the House of Blues. Rock and roll is a team sport. If everybody works together, it works well. These guys are running a million dollar business on the road. You have to move your office every single day. You have payroll, you have insurance to pay, vendors to pay. This marketing is to get out there, get in front of people. We will find Berkeley talents and try to promote their music, develop them as an artist, send their music out to some record labels and maybe get them to sign. The entrepreneurial track, where you learn how to build your own company. We've had a lot of opportunities to work with startups around Boston. And so just getting that exposure as well has helped some of us just think about our own ideas and how to change the music industry. As students interning worldwide, year round. The music industry, I think, is a lot more accessible. When you're doing an internship, you get to learn so much from these people that are actually in it, doing it. Interned for a company called Pledge Music. I was working on building marketing campaigns for artists and pre-sale campaigns. Right now, I'm interning at Spotify and Red Distribution. So I'm working on lifestyle marketing campaigns, grassroots marketing. That's been really helpful in seeing whether those are companies that I'd like to work at or whether I'd like to start my own company that would disrupt the music industry. We have the Berkeley Popular Music Institute focused on students who are working with bands that they ultimately take to the big festivals. I started with BPMI last September. We've gone through the entire cycle of selecting artists putting out a compilation CD, putting on a sold out show, and now making our way to various music festivals around the country. In an industry that's so saturated, it can be really tough to sort of carve out a place for yourself. You can get a team around you, and you can do things that you as just an artist can't do. It's a year round cycle of activities, just like you would find in any record company. We have the Institute for Creative Entrepreneurship for students who are interested in developing new technologies and new businesses. With Berkeley Ice, I have been thinking about how to increase the transparency in the recorded music industry. What we want to do is make sure that they are able to apply what they've learned to a real world experience before they graduate. We can change this industry for the better. You have to stay on your toes and you know keep up with what's going on. Music has never been more widespread. The instant availability of music of all types. And somebody has to be behind all of that. And that's what we are preparing students to do.